Hi there folks, Andrew here at ChatFuel, and today I'm going to show you how to link your Instagram ads to your ChatFuel chatbot. Now, of course, this is super exciting because in the past you could only link your Instagram ads to a website, to a landing page. Now that changes, you can not only send people to the DMs, but you can also have that experience automated. This allows you to achieve personalization at scale, reduce your ad costs, and increase your return on ad spend. So if that sounds interesting to you, stick around. We're gonna cover the tutorial here right now. So here we are in Facebook Ads Manager, and we're going to create a new ad campaign. As you can see, I've already changed the campaign name here to Instagram ad. Obviously, you can call this whatever you like. I'm just going to be covering the basics here, so I'm not going to be giving you a very in-depth tutorial on Ads Manager as a whole. I'm just going to show you what you need to know. So let's scroll down. We can skip through all of these settings and click Next. And here we go. Under Destination and under Ad Type, we want to make sure Click to Message is selected, which it should be by default. And then in this case, we're going to deselect Messenger from the messaging apps. Technically, you can keep it selected, but I would not advise that. So in this case, we're just going with Instagram Direct as the messaging app. Then you'll make sure to select your Facebook page and Instagram account, which I've already done here. We're running it through the chat field account, so looks good. Obviously, in your case, this will be your brand's Facebook page or your client's Facebook page and their associated Instagram account. For budget and schedule, totally up to you, but I'm just going to schedule this, let's say on Friday, just for kicks. Obviously, we can test this before the ad is actually published and live. And then for audience, obviously, you want to adjust all of those settings as well as placements and optimization if you so choose. But in this case, again, we're going to gloss through that, skip over it because it's not super relevant to the Instagram direct ad destination here and linking that to chat field, just kind of icing on the cake. Okay, so then finally here at the ad level, we need to actually create the ad and create the creative, for lack of a better word, that our users, our target audience will see. So I'm going to click here to add media. Let's add an image and I'll choose just a random image here. Let's go with this one. Obviously not relevant to any product or service we're selling. Looks like a nice field or road here, but we'll go with that just for the sake of demonstration here. And if we want, we can include some basic text here as well, like click send message to begin. Clearly, I am the world's best copywriter here. I'm really engaging the audience. But again, this is all just for demonstrational purposes. So we have some sort of caption, some sort of text here. We have the image. And now we can actually set up the message template, which is a little bit different from Facebook click to messenger ads if you're familiar with those. So I'm going to click create here under create new under message template. And here's where we can set up the responses, kind of the frequently asked questions, if you will, because this is the only template you can currently use for these Instagram direct ads. And then I'll show you how to set this up here and link that to chat field. Okay, so this will be the message that users see after they click this send message call to action right here on the ad, right? So they see the ad in their newsfeed, they click send message, and then this pops up once the user clicks one of these options, then it sends them into chat field and you can continue the automation. So that's the workflow here. So for simplicity, let's delete these other two options. Let's just give the user one option here to keep it super simple. And let's ask a question here. Like, let's say, would you like a discount? Okay, so would you like a discount? And here we'll say yes, right? or let's make this a little bit more descriptive and we'll say, sure, I'd like a discount. Okay. And I would actually recommend making these questions as Facebook calls them here, this text right here. I would recommend making these a little bit more verbose, a little bit more detailed and in depth as I've done here. I'm gonna delete that extra space by the way. Um, I would recommend making these kind of longer phrases because if you just, give a response here like yes, there that may cause some problems and I can get into that later, but long story short, best practice to make these phrases a little bit longer instead of just a word or two that a user might type anyway, like yes or no, something like that. Okay, so I'm gonna actually copy this because we're gonna use this phrase later and then we can click save and finish 
And then we're all done here in Ads Manager, so we can click Publish, and we're good to go. Now, while that finishes publishing, we're gonna head on over here into ChatFuel, and we're gonna set up the flow that will continue the conversation that will continue after the user clicks that button, you know, sure, I'd like a discount. So here, let's create the flow. I've already uh, created a new Instagram flow here by clicking this big plus button and choosing Instagram flow. And now here we can, again, continue that conversation. So let's, for example, ask the user for their email. And then if they provide their email, we'll give them a discount code. So let's click add content, text and quick replies. Let's say to get your discount, please enter your email. Again, I'll delete this extra space here and we'll change this user input to email and great. So now after the user enters their email, we'll send them a discount code here and let's choose text and we'll say your discount is 25 off. That's the discount code, right? So let's say your discount code is 25 off. Okay, perfect. So now that we have the ad set up and the conversation that's gonna continue in chat fuel after the user clicks on the ad setup, now we just have one last thing to do, which is to go into the Setup AI tab right here and set up that keyword, the same keyword that we used in the ad and link that to the flow that we just created. So to do that, I'm gonna click Add AI Rule. I'm gonna paste in that phrase that we used in the ad, sure, I'd like a discount. And then here, I'm gonna link that to that flow that we just created, which is called Instagram ad, okay? So again, as a recap, it might seem like a lot of steps here, but it's really not that difficult when you think about it. Step one, we create the ad. Step two, we create the conversational flow in ChatFuel, which is where that ad picks up from. And then third, we set up the keyword here in the Setup AI tab and link that to our flow. So create the ad, set up the conversation in ChatFuel, set up the keyword, and we're good to go. Now we can actually go back into Ads Manager and test this experience. So I'm gonna show you how to do that right now. Let's click X to go back. And now it's gonna show us that ad that we just created. Even though it's still in review, that's okay. We can still test it in the meantime. I'm gonna click preview and then click this button right here, this icon, which is like a box with an arrow. And then we'll click feed ad, send notification to Instagram. So I'm gonna click that. It'll send us a notification on Instagram and let's hop on over to the phone and show you what this full experience looks like from beginning to end from the user's perspective. Okay, so as promised, here we are on the phone and let's preview this ad from the user's perspective. So here we go, we see the ad. I'm gonna click that Instagram direct send message call to action. So I'll click that. Here we see that pop-up that we set up. So I'm gonna click send. It's gonna send that keyword to ChatFuel, which will again then trigger that automation, trigger that flow that we set up. So here we go. I'm gonna click send. And once I do, we'll get that response in a second. There we go. So I'll click that. To get your discount, please enter your email. So let me type in my email. Oops, Demeter at chatfuel.com send and then we'll get that discount code right simple enough so that is how to set up your instagram ad and link it to your chat fuel chat bot if this tutorial was valuable to you be sure to click the like button below leave a comment if you have any questions whatsoever and that's pretty much it thanks so much happy botting